Bloop bloop everyone, welcome back to I'll just gate three. We just defeated Catherick. Unfortunately we had to do it twice because I don't want Jahira to die, and I, I think she's much too weak for this. To actually keep her alive, and it's 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 kinda sad. Um oh I could have looked around a bit and maybe find some stuff. You know what? I'm gonna do that real quick. Be right back. Okay, nothing there, so that's fine. Um, yeah, and we're standing here with Jahira. Jahira told us that we need to go down there. I really hope we don't need to get her with us. I don't think we do. Um, I saw that she joins even if you don't bring her with, but you just, we have to say here that, well, she has to survive until here, and you have to tell her that she should join. But I want Gale there for sure, so we'll do that. Let's go down. Let's see. Um, yes, game. I, I want that. Thanks. Uh, you peer down the hole left by the tentacle that drew Catherick into the darkness. Will you leap after him? I mean, we could sell stuff first. We didn't get much here anyway, so it should be fine. The hole yawns back at you, impossibly wide. Oh, A how disgusting. tentacle burrowed through stone. Well, and that tentacle we touched before. Hmm. It's hentai haven, guys. This must be where they harvest the tadpoles. We're close to the source of the infections. Also, look like Slanesh's bum hole, but sure. All of this sitting beneath moonrise. For how long? And how deep does it go? That is a thing. We don't really know how long. How deep does it go? Nothing here. The Mind Flayer Colony. We can't get back. We have to spend our resources. Um, a little bit of precaution now. A little bit cautious. Oh, wow, too. Mm. Tread carefully. We are very close to the source of the Absolute now. That telepathic storm has become a tempest. So, Gale says, it strikes me that for a Mind Flayer colony, there are remarkably few Mind Flayers about the place. Yeah, kind of. No Mind Flayer so far. There is a uh, Intellect Devourer. That's nice. Hello? She waits, huh? Attacking. Perhaps they think we're the same as them. We have tadpoles, so probably. I'm gonna hit the little shit though. There's another one coming in. Should kill. That is so strong that Shillelagh, my god. Is that ridiculous? I don't want to see her. Wait, wasn't that a hit? Yes, it's disadvantage, I know, but I'm not gonna get closer. Because that thing is gonna come to us with a dash, which is fine. I'm not going to use anything against two of these guys. Oh, come on. Apparently, I'm still not able to hit for shite. But, you know. Nice. Two brains delivered just towards us. Another step forward. Oh, now we have the Elixir of Psychic Resistance? What? Should we have that already for a long time? Not the first brain we got. So... Oh, look at that. How pretty. Let's go to the right here first. Hmm. Pretty. Ooh. A morgue. How many did, huh? Never 
is shop level five. Look at that. This is us. We found us again. Yay! Why is it hurt? Hmm. It is friendly though. I would like to heal it. Mm. Sort of chop. No will sparks behind his eyes. His mind has been hollowed out to better echo the commands of the collective. How nice. You could kill it, end its miserable life of enslavement. Surely that would be the humane thing to do. We could I think take advantage so. of its vulnerability and plunder what's left of its hollow mind for anything that could serve you. Hmm. No, what is this place? No, sorry. Here. They become. The nursery. Yeah, look at look at the back. Yeah, it looks like a nursery to me too, right? Mmm. Tasteful. Become what? Part of one mind. Four little feet dancing to same song. So With a lurch, you realize he means the intellect of yeah. ours. Here the brains are harvested, made part of the hive mind. But there is one little kitty dances to another song. Same song as you. Interesting. So he means us. Um, where can I find this little kitty? Locked up. Bad kitty. Thinks it is other. What did you do to all these people? Chop, chop. Help them. Become. Oh, God. I need to find your master, Catherick. Ma Stop. Ma Down. Deep. One. Off. Three. One. Off. Three. Interesting. Okay. So, down. Why don't I send you to join all these creatures you butchered? <sighs> Yes. Yes. Please. Poor guy. Poor, poor guy. Let's murder him. Pick to fight the cons. I mean, he Not asked us long. to in a way, right? Time for jump. Shut up. <laughs> in the face. Okay, I'm actually not that good in, uh, well, 21 AC like Shadowheart, so without even having heavy armor. But that is just because I have the, no. No, I don't have the, oh no, it's because of the of the gloves, yeah, for the dexterity. Plus four in dexterity. Um, no, let's just kill him. I don't need executioner. Yeah, I don't need animations game, it's fine. He's still alive. I'm not even raging. Oh, I get more damage when I'm raging. That's okay, though. I don't think I need to. We got some intellect devourers. That's okay. Wow. We'll deal. I could do a level 1 spell here. I have so much health. Just to kill him, maybe, and then maybe this guy. Free at last. No more chop. Exactly, buddy. Good. Everyone who's dashing doesn't attack. That's good. We have one attack there. That's fine. Two attacks there. That's fine. Shadow heart. Mm. Could burn them. Holy Hellfire. Always something something I like. Um, yeah, help your beloved. Or just critically miss and be a fool. That was good. Not really a lot of damage, which makes me sad. Wow, 27. Kill one alone. 
And you would too. If you only hit for once. If you would only hit for once. Um, you'll still need to get somewhere first. Yeah, we have Arcane Synergy that gives us... Weapon attacks deal additional damage equal to the affected entity spell casting. Mm. Weapon damage. Okay, maybe this ring isn't what I want. Why did I keep this? It's weapon attacks. I wanted spell stuff. Okay, maybe I need to get rid of this ring. And maybe I take this one. I had the other one, right? I could take the cannot be blinded. That is actually quite good for him. Or the mind shield. Why did I think I want this ring? Maybe I didn't did never read it? Oh. Yeah, yeah, come. Oh, there's another one coming. Right here. Yeah, it's fine. They can't do anything. Uh, hit him. Poor little guy. Wow, she actually does damage. The, the poison really helps. Ah, oh, sadness. Yeah, these are not close combat spells. How much damage can I do? Nothing. Okay, damage. Let's help here. Well, that sucks. A one. We rolled a one. <laughs> See? She could have just killed it outright. God damn it. Eat. That was a good heal, even. Just shock him. Oh, I wanted to say that's a shocking experience, but apparently it's not. Death. Is it dead? Yeah, I want, I want that one. At least when it's prone, you can hit someone. I mean, I only have them with me because they, A, I already paid for them, and B, um, they can take hits. A toy block. I got the cage key. Good. There's a lot of stuff around. And yes, we're gonna take it all. Again, we goblin guys. For the long hours. A lot of hours that we played this, and we, we need to know. I'm a loot gobble. We are free! Thank you, friend. Free, but free! But perils remain near and far. Better to stay together. You and us, we... We will remain with you. Call us, and we will be at your side. Yay, we have a friend. This was the this was the same brain we rescued out of the skull in the first episode, guys. That's how far we've come. Us is with us still. Why don't we have this as a Oh yes, we do. But for some reason this spell went away at some point. Yeah, it is not part of my normal stuff. Weird. But we got the brain as well. Yeah, we have this thing. So if this goes away, then we have the other thing. Hello. Ah, oh, look at that. Level 4, 55. Luckily, at least this thing. Okay. Prepare the match. Sure. At least, at least us leveled up a bit. Unfortunately, Doggo didn't. I think I can still get Doggo. Yeah, look at that. I kind of scratch as well. Unfortunately, he doesn't level. There is a mod, though. That's what I wanted to say. There is a mod now that levels these two um, a little bit. Not really make them really powerful or anything, but just makes them more relevant. 
Because they're really not. I mean, us is way more relevant than Scratch now. But look at Scratch. And uh, it also levels... Uh, his guy. It also levels the little... The little fork. What is it called? Here, the, the quasit. It also levels our quasit fork. Which is nice. Uh, it doesn't level Scratch that much because he's really powerful with his help action, so... Hey, Simino, how are you doing? Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Friend. We just found an old friend! You? Uh, you may draw the wrong sort of attention if people see you by my side. We will not cause you any trouble, friend! We will project a different form that will cloak us from all but your closest acquaintances. <laughs> you and your friends shall see us as we truly are! All others shall see a kitty, a small predator, <laughs> indigenous to this world. They kitties can walk anywhere, and they are most cunning. <laughs> that is the explanation for why we can have a very weird looking brain on four feet go with us in Bulger's Gate in the city later. And no one is suspicious at all. <laughs> this is the explanation. Hey, Zapsy, thank you for the lurk. Very nice of you. I'm good, dude. How are you this nice evening, man? Well, I'm playing but just gate, so I'm great. <laughs> um, you were keen to join me. Don't you want to serve the Absolute? Not Absolute. The Absolute does not care about us. And we do not care about the Absolute. We are different. And we are saved. Friend! So I would like to see what happens when you... Um, they're still called us. Shouldn't they be called we now? Weird. Uh, I would like to see how different their stats are when you mangle the brain in, in the first uh, first few minutes of the game. Because then it's probably not like this. It's probably worse. But I don't know. Since I didn't do it. First I wanted to murder it even. But then I thought, well, let's see how that goes. When I played this game first. Okay, we find some stuff. A ball even. But we got us back. Yay. It took really a lot for me to not spoiler this. When we when we took the brain first, you know, when we took it out of the skull. Not design, but death. Okay. Ending of the second act, guys. It's coming. A butchered mind. We need to take that with us. That's important. Uh, we found some things. Letter to the Absolute. A childish scrawl ringed, with, ringed by doodles. Dear Absol Absolute. <laughs> Teacher says to write. He says it is like a prayer. We can see your tower now. I hope it is bright and smells nice like Mother's Temple. Teacher says she will follow us soon. Please send Teacher better dreams. He's grumpy. And when he is tired, he bounces the cart around a lot. He promised to all be quiet and good so he can sleep. Oh, poor children. This book has all but crumpled in, uh, to dust, making it impossible to read. Uh, and list of rules. A list written with the painstaking care of a child. Certain entries are underlined as if for memorization. Teacher's rules. Write in teacher's card away from the soldiers. Don't look the guide in the eyes. Stay in the light, stay in the light, stay in the light. <sighs> Poor children. That were abused here and made into time. brains. What would this have done? Oh! An offering from Moonrise Towers. And yes, that's the other side of the Lake of the Blood that we have seen. Interesting. So that is how the corpses got here. Can I do that again? I mean, I could take a shower in that, but no thanks. So this is the lake. 
Yeah, if you remember, we were if you if you fell fell down here or, or jumped down into the offering thing in the prison, then that's where you land. Not that we specifically did that, but let's move on from here. Hmm, hentai haven, isn't it nice? Oh, bad. Undeads. And it's zombies with undead fortitude. Can only be killed by spirit damage or uh, here by the uh, radiant damage or by crits. Which is nice that Carla does good crits, but it's a winged horrors, level 3. So they're not really strong, but there are a lot of them. Oh, the zombies are strong, apparently. And there's a death shepherd. Oh, crap. Um, here we need to. Carla needs to be at her best. Why can't you reach destination? That's a lie game. Yeah, this is reckless. I don't want to use the executioner for such a dumb creature. I might use it for the shepherd. Yeah. First turn problems. Might work. Sad critical misses all the freaking time. Should I? I think I shall. Uh, I want the owl bear. I just love the owl bear. It's just such a cool creature and scary. Yeah, that's okay. You can just gather up here, guys. Another winged horror flying in. Or maybe not. Yeah, Scratches boy, I think you're kind of useless in this fight. Just, just stay here until you're needed. Um, and to not have fun with everyone here. How about we do this? So they don't, you know, annoy us too, too much. I mean, the winged horror can just fly over, but that's fine. Or they just leave. It's okay as well. I don't care about those guys. Um, This winged horror is almost dead, so I'm gonna just hit him once. Obviously, that's a critical miss for sure. What else would it be? The woodward cannot jump, so we need to be careful. They can get through. 75% chance. Just wanted to say that again. Damn it. Uh, yeah. Us has some new abilities now. Devour intellect. Consume a creature's mind. If its intellect uh, intelligence is below 4, it takes damage and is stunned. Otherwise, its intelligence is reduced to three, uh, by 3. That is weird. That is new. Not when I did this and reduced it to 0, it didn't do much for them. So many enemies, indeed. And that's not that's not the most that we have seen so far. But my god, it's a lot. And also they have a Death Shepherd, so every zombie we kill can be reincarnated again. Synaptic Discharge, expel a wave of telepathic energy. So that's just psychic damage. But these things have 7 intelligence, and we reduce it by 4. I, I think we reduce it by 5, is the thing. Uh, but I should kill this thing if I can. Yeah, psychic damage to death, so it doesn't do anything anymore, and we'll try the intellect devouring thing in a second. Shadow Heart. You could just burn him. Doesn't do much damage anyway. That's the problem. If I don't use spells with her, she's just not that great. Uh, you know what? This is good, though, because this gives them Radiant Orb and Reverberation. Which is quite nice. There's the Orb. Radiating Orb makes him visible and less attack rolls per turn. That you still have Radiating Orb. Yeah, see? That sucks. I thought they would all get here, like these stupid zombies. 
But apparently the shepherd is is absolutely content with just never coming to us. God, the spike growth already did that much damage. Look at that. And now they're all clumped up together. You know what we can do? We can make this even better. Preparing for a nice fireball. Because I can use this and use the void bulb. And just make all of these guys. I never used that before, but it's really nice. Oh, I should have clumped these guys too. Uh, and now we'll just kill this guy. At 30, damn. Uh, yes, Carla? Sometimes the game has these hiccups. It's kind of weird. But it's a thing. Okay, yes, you go here. So they have a target. Nice dash. Uh, yeah, Scratch, I'm sorry, you're still not useful. Just don't want you to instant die. I don't need to redo this. It's her spike growth. I don't need her to get out there that much. Still breathing, despite everything. I could just jump in here. I could also leave that for Gale. Oh, look at that. That's easy targets. And they do have Undead Fortitude. I'm, I'm not sure if they would really die. I could push you in. God, I love the, the Owlbear. Such a fun, fun thing. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it here. And we'll see what the death guy does, because we might be able to eradicate most of these guys now with a nice placed... A ball of flames. Can I get all of them? Yes, I can. Oh, yes, I can. Unfortunately, fire isn't what kills them, but radiant, so... Yeah, look at that. They all regenerated one point. Unless we crit, they are not going to die. Well, I'll try to crit there. Devouring intellect's not possible with undead, as far as I know. Yeah. Maybe? Apparently psychic works? That wasn't a crit. And it, it, Undead Fortitude is wait, wait, not all of them have that. You do. When reduced to zero hit points, regain one hit point. Oh, yeah, one hit point instead. Unless the damage was radiant or caused by a critical. So not all of them have that. Just the zombies. Well, let's see. I mean, we do have the radiant for them. For some of them. Oh, Undead Fortitude goes away after that happened once. Okay. Now I see. Okay, okay, okay. Um, is there a way to get under, uh, to get uh, get that there? Yes, there is. That means I run in there. Unfortunately, because this is the thing. So I would need to jump there and then do my Spirit Guardians, which I don't want to do. What I could do is this. Sunbeam. I can't reach. Well, I'll get rid of him. This guy is the problem. Yeah, no rest for the wicked again. And we get more reconstitution. And he's running. You little coward that you are. We're still killing them far quicker than he can spawn them. So, we're fine. Yeah, you're healing and then you're dying. Yeah, he killed himself. No. He's back. No fortitude anymore, though. God, this is so worth it, these spikes. And they're free. 
after the level 4 slot that we used to summon her. The Dryad, but damn, it's so good. And you know what we need? Most of them are dead. Now we just snipe them away. Or what we could also do... Could that kill though? We have some holy water. No, it couldn't. Can't kill any of these. They're too, they're too strong right now. Well, if they're too strong anyway, I'm just gonna make them... interference sorry I had to cough uh, so frost is resisted okay yeah then I don't know get some acid on them like this greater zombie here no also not four times no also no my god they all saved anyway. Donculus. You're flying. That was obvious that you would. Nice thing is when they when they miss on Karlak, they would kill themselves with radiant damage, which would be really nice and fun. Uh, I could move the brambles a bit if I wanted to. No, I think I think they're fine there. Let's just go in there and hit him. Very hard with the for the free end snare as well. Great. Can't move away though. Nice critical. Yeah, I'm going to jump in. Or not. You can land there, game. You're telling me that, that he can land there, so do it, please. Sometimes it just then doesn't do it for some reason. Almost dead. Uh, you're about a sure death. Yes, he... Oh, he didn't even come back because he landed on the things. Oh, that was unfortunate. That was actually hurting a lot. But he landed on these on these brambles and then uh, died. But look at that, we have the fight perfectly under control. Just because of this. It's such a good spell. Um you know what? This needs to be up there. I don't know why you why you put that somewhere else. Or rather. Uh, put this down here. I don't need that that often. I actually use this once. Because it takes my action away and I only have one. Uh, don't want to use another fireball if, if I can avoid it. We need to be a little conservative with our stuff. So, two inches of damage. I like to use it because it gives you more lightning charges as well. Even though it's not the best cantrip for him. Or, no, it's, it's a cantrip is probably more what I should say. Crit? Oh my god, he actually crit or killed him. <laughs> nice. For once, they did good. Can you jump over this? Not at all. So, us is a little bit hampered here. Good one, though. Yeah, that makes us so much more useful with these, with these different attacks that I can do now. Uh, are all these zombies? No, they're not. They're not dead. Why was I thinking they're dead? Probably hoping they're dead. Uh, I could do a sunbeam, but there's a big fat owl bear in the way, so some nice reverberation and some nice light. It's way too dark in here. We need to have some lights, I think. Oh God, you're annoying. What a coward this thing is. Oh wow, you can make you can make Okay. Spellcasters. Uh, 
Yeah, that's annoying. We need to move the brambles now. But if you're dashing, that's fine and you can't attack. Oh, look at that. The symbol of the absolute, by the way. Right there. Um, hmm. <laughs> I don't like that. I'm not a ranger with her, so... Well, now we have some light. That's neat. Will she take that damage? Yeah. Do I really care? No. Need and I'm not gonna hard. jump, so... Difficult terrain doesn't, she doesn't care about. So I could provoke a crit if I really wanted to. But I don't. I could throw him. Sure. Ah, <laughs> nice critical against this guy. Damn. That was neat. Using a zombie to kill another skeleton. Ah. Oh. Fun times. And I mean it's bludgeoning damage. 100% bludgeoning for sure. And we still have this guy here. Um Problem is moving this is not ideal. But sure. It will hit us both, but Because that's one instant of damage. But it's fine. And next time we're just gonna whack one. As long as you don't move, it's fine here. Nice, good one. Any anything to gain? No. I'm gonna going to use a level one to heal me a bit not doing much. A three. Oh, garbage. Um, Gale does not have Radiant, which is always sad. I could stun them. No, it's not stunning. Okay, it's disadvantage on attack rolls. Yeah, it's not really good for no no damage then. Because that would not do, uh, not do much. It would do a little damage. We could make them frozen. Reducing their, their movement speed a bit more. Or just miss. It's also fine, I guess. Hit him, please. Double crit, weirdly enough. I don't know why we get two instances of that. I don't know. Just get two. Not against it. Can we make... You know, can we make these guys dumber? They're only in four. Yes, we can. I would stun him. Oh, he still has a one. Oh, it's a minus three. Otherwise, its intelligence is reduced by three. It wasn't below four. Okay. Okay. They changed that. They definitely changed that. I think that that always took five down. And it didn't stun them. Um, or do damage, but which I think it should. Normally in D and D, as far as I know, if you reach zero in any stat, you just die. Like zero strength, you can't even breathe anymore because you're so weak. Just which, which means you die. Zero constitution, you just brittle and <laughs> crumble or something. I don't know. To me. Whatever the DM says, that means. She can't kill him with this because she doesn't get double damage, which is annoying. The shadows were much nicer because Radiant did double damage on them. Made her so powerful. But it's still the radiating orb thing and the rever reverberation. And now it's five, which means he's saved. That's annoying to me because reverberation should make him prone. And I don't like that they can save against that. When the entity has five or more turns of reverberation, it takes thunder damage and possibly falls prone. Otherwise, it's... Oh, no, it is removed afterwards. Well, great. So, that is garbage. That makes reverberation so much 
Chris. Now we got a marksman as well. My goodness, could you please come towards us and do something? Thank you. It's finally getting there. Withering theft. Rob a creature of its life force and gain 20 temporary. Yeah, I don't think you will do that. It's a level 4. Well, there goes my level 4. That was a crappy spell. Very mean one. Look upon your fatal future. And yes, I don't care that the guy um, spawns more people because I have control over the fight. They, he can spawn 50, 1500 and I wouldn't care because it's just a trickle. And I don't even need to use much um, in terms of... of... Uh, of things to to, to kill them. Ow. Yeah. Ha ha ha! He killed himself with a miss, as I said. Nice. Oh, really? I can't reach him? I can. I'm not gonna use Executioner against this guy. Yeah, look at that. One swipe dead. Uh. Here, yeah, enjoy some holy water, boys. Should do damage either way, right? <laughs> Did you get holy watered? No, nothing special there. Um, they don't have a holy spell, a holy, a holy arrow, unfortunately, which is kind of sad. Like salving should do something there. No, it doesn't. Make sure Elmata then. No more hit points for you. Hit. There was a. No, I don't think. I think it's lying. Poor doggo. And now she can't reach anymore. Hmm. She cannot jump as well. But you know what? I don't need this here anymore. I need it here. <laughs> I know she can't either, but at least she's not gonna get killed. So that guy is dead. Um, yeah, now I can do this. Woohoo! Well, that was kind of stupid game, wouldn't you say? Stupid profane womb. Profane womb bound. And held in its place by profane womb. Ah, that's what happened to him. Damn it. Yeah, I'm not gonna move. That was annoying that I got bound by that. Annoying and stupid. Anything else? No, it's just these three. Oh yeah, this guy. Mm. Mm. Come on, crit. Sad. Uh, us could kill him for sure. Yeah, sure. Like, I like how it skitters. It's kind of weird, but oh, us is us is cool. Um, I can't kill this, but I won't because that would be too easy. It's nice. Oh, that's not good. Uh, no, he can't break me out, but you could. Or you could just run around and kill yourself. That's great. Yeah, that's a perfect idea, buddy. Hey, you were dashing. That's yeah, fine. Cheater. Want another? 
Definitely reckless. Uh, sure. Yes, crit. I didn't get the paralyzing crit, probably because I had a thing already. I don't think I can I can uh, throw him. No, oh, if only you could get far enough. I still don't know what the mysterious liquid does. Does anyone know? I mean, I have played through this game. I don't think that's much of a spoiler anymore. Don't lose concentration, girl. Oh, and maybe hit would be a, the second choice. Or maybe never hit at all. Why did I get a concentration sa saving throw? I don't know. It's fine. Let's kill the guy. Come on. Boop, boop. Nice. Still have no idea what this liquid does. Again, if anyone knows. Oh, that's a nice thing with the transformations. Also... There we go. Now we can actually move around. I don't think there's anything useful in these. Well, the stuff he, he has uh, made. I'm going to it again. Not this one. There's a reason for these for these butchered mines. The city calls out we have some in camp. Oh, is there is there? Oh no! Should I should have gotten those before I've gone down here? I may should have. That's annoying. And I'm disgusted by these wombs. God, this would take for a uh, take done? ages. Open up. Of many hearts, one soul. Oh, that takes a long time. Me? So you're gonna do that though. We have more of these these brain jars, and I wanted to have them with me, but I forgot. I forgot that we cannot just go to camp here. Which is kind of meh. And yes, I'm just gonna kill these things. I don't know what they're really for. I just know I don't want them here. There's something down there. Oh yeah, I know what that is. That is cool. Something there. Okay, Gortag needs to do this. Oh, there is a problem. Um, keep them. Keep these guys here. Because we need to jump, as you can see, and us is not good enough to jump back up. I'm not silenced, game. Okay. Well, let's look at this. This is this is really cool. The console bursts into life. A mind touches your own. Alien and full of desperate need, but fragmented too. It is incomplete. It yearns to connect, but needs you to guide the process, linking each part of your mind to Sorry. its like. We have a real puzzle, guys. Begin. We have a real puzzle here. So, what we need to do is, is connect these systems, memory, emotion, speech, and reason, to the other side, to the corresponding things. So, I have no idea how this worked. But I see this is speech, this is memory, this is speech. And we cannot overlap, which is kind of hard to do. Oof. Emotion. I think emotion needed to go here. 
Hier, hier. Ja, uh, yeah, und dann ab hier and down here and to this. So we have emotion. Let's go with speech. Back to here. Oh, that is... That is not an easy thing to do because now... Ah, yeah, maybe through this way. This looks very much like a thing. The mind is trying to do things. Reason uh, seems pretty straightforward, but the question is, where's the last thing? Memory. Memory wouldn't make it. Yeah, memory already has problems, but let's just go with reason for a second. Well, welcome back, Master. Uh, 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 uh. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have no memory. So memory can only connect here or here. So this is probably wrong. Ma. Ma. Well, that doesn't work. Welcome. Okay, I want memory. Uh, yeah, this doesn't work. So memory can only go two ways, here or here. While emotion can only go one way. So emotion has to be here. That means memory has to be here. The question is, where could we bring these two instead? Well, emotion could go up instead. So I'm going to go for emotion. And go back. And we probably have to bring this up. But memory has to go here. There's no other way. And then it has to go here, here, and here. Well, no. It could go down instead, instead of going up here. But we'll do this. And let's see how that works. Um, now, emotion can go about everywhere, right, from this point. Oh, yeah. You didn't need to go there. Oh, shite. Is that reset? Oh, it's reset now. The mind still desperately yearning for connection. So, we want this to go back. And we want this to go here. There, then there. I think this is the only way speech can go. What happened? Because that note is possible. Ma. Ma. Okay, so... Stir. This Welcome. is not necessary. Go back. Thank you. Now you can go here. And can go here. Well, that's... Yeah, that's emotion. Emotion, emotion. You have to be here. Oh, that's it! To see what's back there. That was it already. Okay, so this is this is the way to go. So you you try to connect them once, and then you see which one can only can only go which way, and it, it just solves itself apparently. Not that hard of a of a puzzle, but a fun one, and it's cool that this is in here as well, which is very normal D and D stuff, uh, at least from what I I heard some people are playing uh, with in these kinds of games. Well, actually. I heard that from a DM that actually does uh, the black eye, but, you know. So we've got the Blade of Oppressed Souls and the Waking Mind. Ooh, the Waking Mind is interesting. Um, and also, we have a Desecrated Relief. This looks different. Your tadpole echoes, not with presence, but memory, tinged with loss. The grand design, order. That's an order, Lloyd, by the way. We just see the grand design of the elithids. Mm. 
Und zwar geht das Brain sucked out. That loss blooms into a sudden fury, burying claws in your mind. Taken. Corrupted. Gone. And just as suddenly, pain and memory are gone, leaving only stone once more. The grand yeah. design. Exactly. The restoration of the Mind Flayer Empire. The dream of all Illithids. With everyone. How did the Illithid Empire fall? Well, the Githyanki had the hand in I'm that. Just glad it fell. Yeah, we all are. So, everyone bowing to them, as they should from their mind, and uh, just being eaten and stuff because they can. You know, the grand design. But this is an optional area and you might not find this, but it's really cool. We also found the Sword of Oppressed Souls. Or the Blade of Oppressed Souls. 1d10 or 1d8. It's a versatile weapon, that's why. And psychic damage. That's about in fragments of dead souls are imprisoned in their steel. Angry, powerful, hopeful, or scared. All of them no rose up against their illithid masters. And all of them fell to this blade. Now they are trapped forever, forced to aid their oppressors. It's an illithid sword. Interesting. Crowning strike. Unleash the wails of the dead that fell to your blade and possibly instill crown of madness in the target. That's not bad, actually. Wow. Interesting. But I don't think we want that sword with us. Uh, it's an it's a unique one, so it's gonna go to camp. I don't like to sell those. But yeah, pretty cool little thing. And behind a, a fun little puzzle. Why are you down here? Why are these guys down here? That I I disconnected you guys. You shouldn't have come. And you too. Us. Great. It's probably because we talked to them, but the thing is, they can't come with us now. So now I have to, unfortunately, maybe, maybe you can? No, it's too high. Now I have to disband you all. Um, okay, wonder what happened there. Ah, oh, now you exploded. Oh no, I didn't! Oh, I'm an idiot. Well, it's fine. You could have just ported. If you have a port point, no, we don't. Okay, no, it's fine. We can't port, so I'm gonna get rid of you. Uh, you might be able to. Yes, you're immobile. I know. Give it a second. Okay, Scratch can can come with us. Problem is, I cannot summon the others anymore. Well, the level four spell slot I could use to summon them technically, but I don't think I'm gonna right now. And us, I cannot summon until a short rest. So we'll wait. Although they're quite nice. It's kind of stupid that they can't get up there. It's an oversight, in my opinion. But oh. more brains. I'm gonna kill them right now. Okay, I think we went around. Yeah, as you can see. We did go around, and up here and up here is something. I think we need to go up here because there's Zariel's acid right here. Uh, I don't know why we have the to do still. That's fine. Uh, this is exactly not where I want to be. Oh, Liberate, evacuate, obey. Cool. This is where we came from. Oh, this map. Map is just the greatest. We need to go here to, to freeze Ariel's asset. Since that is something we had to do, we had on our list. Well, let's see who the great and famous asset is. Oh god. Uh, this is not the asset. Players and civilians, side by side. This must be where they infect and transform those they kidnap. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's a mind flayer, all right. Level eight. How close are we to level ten? This is a stream of fragmented memories and emotions. All that remains of the pod inhabitants' former self. Delirium. Mania. 
laughter. His mind broke before the end, and he was laughing uncontrollably as the skin fell from his face. Was that the monk? We do have the monk amulet, right? Don't we have the monk amulet? Yes, we do. We do have the amulet. Weird that he doesn't say anything there. That might be him. His former body. Oh, look at that. It's Sevlor. The shattered windows of Alterel's high cathedral. The burning black sky of Avernus beyond. In its horror, the blood war unites you. Tiefling, dwarf, and elf alike huddle behind the shields of your paladin order, waiting for salvation. But when it comes, disunity, the returned city casts your people out, the devils who drag them down to hell. In the end, it is not your paladin oath that is broken, it is your faith itself. Hmm. So the city turned them away, Elturel? There's no one the device here. device does not react to your presence. Courage, conviction, defiance. Even as her organs began to dissolve, she believed she could resist. The mind flare. Poor woman, nothing there, nothing there. Another one here. That's another mind flayer. Oh god, that's at least I count at least four. There's another person though. Another, yeah, and another person. Amusement, curiosity, fascination. He believed the horrors of moonrise to be a fleeting dream that fade on waking. This pod pulsates with the angry memories of Raven Guard's search officer, Manip Shurga. She laments her failure to locate him. Please. Desperation, pain, terror. Cultists raided his village. He was the sole survivor. Oh, that's not nice. Your lungs burn with the dry heat of the fires raging about you. Pain is not enough to diminish your swing. One goblin after another falls to your blade. A man's voice cries out through the thick smoke. Raven guard, you call, but the clang of swords and spell shouts of attacking drow are your only reply. Okay, let's just get rid of these brains first before we... Have to decide what happens to these mind flayers and people. Um, I don't want any bystanders Need to act fast. that draw, you know, possible attacks away. Um, that thing is dead. That's one. Five remain. Kala, go to the back there. Murder this one. I'm not gonna rage for this. We need our rage in a second, I bet. Ooh, 85%. He's really much better in hitting this. Ah, oh, see, that's why I want the double. Dashing is fine, though. Yeah, go to Kala. That's a good idea. Kala will rip you apart. Doggo. Ooh, good damage. And I mean, he is a hit. He draws away one attack that could be life or death in some situations. Or well, you're gonna take a while to get here. Mm. It's a 90% hit chance. Hit him. Combat looting is really nice, I think. It saves you the time afterwards, and it doesn't take actions or anything, which is very fair, in my opinion. That's not what I wanted, that you get so close, but sure. But it is very fair, and look at the reach that she has now. Amazing. Children. Away. Don't 
Let's do this twice. Should have shocked him. Oh, you could have killed that thing. Darn it. I like the reverberation that you give him. Mm, good damage. Uh, yeah, girl. And Carla will do the rest. The with this guy. Good. That's what I wanted. Just get rid of these things real quick. Okay, and now we'll do this. Hopefully that makes everything a little bit lighter. Because it puts three to one. Okay, now there is another console here. What can we do with those? Console forms a telepathic connection with the device. And a chorus of static energy fills your mind. Every mind flayer in the room calls out hungrily from its pod, seeking release and sustenance. But there are others in the pods, those not yet infected, not yet a lithid, terrified, desperate to escape. Desperate. Yes, yeah, Zephlor, we need to rescue these guys. Some other flaming fists as well. The device is open to your tadpole's command, to your authority. But we have the choice of release or purge. We could actually kill all of them. But no, we're gonna release. I could have placed my people in the right place. Mole, find mole apparently, was a thing here. So we opened the pods releasing a host of mind flayers. We're in for a fight. And mole, there was no sign of mole in the tadpoling center of the mind flayer colony. She must have found a way back out of this accursed place. And we knew, this is just speculation. I don't think if you even can find out what happened, but we know that she was in with Raphael and that he, you know, made her offers. And maybe she took it right here. That might be a thing. Maybe we'll find out about it. I don't I don't even know. Because I I there were some hints that say that before, but I'm not sure. There are a lot of mind flayers here. Um how about we kill this Come one? On, Show them who you are. <laughs> For lack of a better target, also do this, because it's Mind Flayers. They are ridiculously strong. Yeah, sure. And we do Reckless, I don't care. Do I go Paralyzing Critical would be nice here. Um, I think I'm gonna use this, but I'm gonna use the Saber Tooth. I'm gonna go here and try to help these guys. Nice critical. Oh, I hate that tadpole charm, but good. We resisted. Unfortunately, you didn't fall prone, and I don't know why. You shouldn't have the biggest AC, though. 15? Yeah, 15 is not... Yeah, well, great. Watch for that. Yes! Smite them! Finally, we have a paladin on our side. That was a great smite. Uh, da -da -da. We need to help them. We need to help all of them. Be the best thing that Gale could do. I mean, they're an aberration, so monster would probably be no target. Yes, monster works. So aberration would work. This is a level five, though, so we can only do this once for thirty percent. I don't think that's the best thing we can do. What we could do is haste. Let's haste ourselves. We need a long rest anyway soon. Um, and let's go. Oh, Phantasmal Killer is also really garbage. Fun times. We need to go and kill one of these. Zevlor, enjoy the help. Charm won't work, buddy. Strike Not with me. Oh god. Only tentacle whip is fine. Yes, get an extra hit. Oh, that's a 30. He's almost dead. Darn it. Here, help, Scratch. Fight him. Oh god. That could have worked. 
How often can you guys do that? That's not fair. Shadowheart, what can she do here? Okay, she can fear multiples, but that's not a good cone. You could dominate one. Oh, must be a humanoid. I don't know, guys. What can we do? We could do necrotic. Necrotic should be fine with them, right? Yeah. Uh, you know what? This guy's almost dead. Let's make him dead. That was not the best spell to do that with. Great. Well done, Gary. You suck. I hope you feel bad. <sighs> Levitate. Equip nothingness. And get a free hit. Perfect. Nice. Also with poison. Oh, wow. A stun? Really? What was that stun? Tentacle rip stun. Wow, all tadpole charms don't work. And that is something because these guys have a lot of charisma. Good, shred the armor. Yes, prone, good. Unfortunately, I can't use that. And we're not frenzied anymore because we're stunned. That is death. Well, well done. Nice, another one. And is almost dead as well. Uh, I'm just going to use this. Sure. Torment. <laughs> level up! Yes, that's what I wanted to look at. Oh my god, we're level 10. Nice. Oh, that's going to be amazing for us. Oh, and of course, you can do twice. Uh, I don't know. If you do Phantasmal Killer, that's concentration, so you can't, because you would let lethargic yourself. Um, I don't know. I really don't. Lightning Bolt? Some nice lightning in his face? Step to it. He is a level 3, so we'll cast a level 4. It's so... No, I'm not gonna. You wouldn't probably heal yourself, but you might. Let's do that. Or not. He could technically heal himself. That's why I didn't want that. Not enough movement. Not enough movement. Well done, Scratch. Who's next? This guy is. But you are both fighting next, so I'll give you an advantage here. Or I don't. It's fine. Super tadpole charm. Nice. Good hit. Come on, kill him. Stab him again. Ah, only one stab and rage ended, of course. I'm not gonna rage again here. I want one for bad times. Yeah, this is good. Something we don't do often. It doesn't even close uh, the damage that Zevlor does with the smite. And he has the same smites. That this is serial tiefling smites. Time to push my luck again. Yeah, well, this thing's dead. And level up. I love it. I don't know where you got the amethyst from, but I take it. Shouldn't have made me your enemy. Exactly. <sighs> or maybe it didn't, you know, change anything. Come on, hit once. That was a searing smite, even. Hells. I didn't think I was going to make it. Thank you. I owe you an explanation. Much more than that. But first, please. He's not talking to Gurtok, yeah. The, the ambush. Tell me they survived. Unfortunately, because I was uh, shapeshifted, which is stupid, I should be kicked out of shapeshift for this, in my opinion. Or give me a a setting that says, yeah, you get kicked out, and it's always, you know, going through the uh, through the order of people. 
Because then it's always me they're talking about, and I want that, because it's Gotak's story, goddammit. Uh, anyway. You abandoned them? Do you really think they have the right to ask? Some others ended up in a cell. That's on you. They found refuge, but what the hell's happened out there? Uh, I, I think one and two are bad. Hey, Mimido, welcome back. Um, one and two are bad. I want the third one. They found refuge, but what the hell's happened out there, Zevlor? And I mean... Shadowheart probably before, when she was with Shah, she would have taken one or two. Probably two. But now she thinks differently about some things. And I think that that manifests a little bit through that already. So yeah, they found refu ref refuge. But what the hell's happened out there, Zevlor? You've heard some of it, I'm sure. That I froze, or broke, or some other lie that is kinder than the truth. We were ambushed by cultists, yes. And then I heard... Her. Their false god. Whispering promises in my mind. I would be a paladin again. With a god's purpose, a god's power. Everything I needed to protect my people. And all the while, the cult tortured them. They fought and ran and died around me. While I imagined myself their savior. By the time I regained my senses, it was too late. I did not just surrender to the Absolute. For a moment, I welcomed it. Yeah, that must be very hard. Really. It sounds like you were being enthralled. It's not your fault. Yeah. The people didn't need a paladin. They saved themselves. Uh, I mean... It doesn't matter if they need them. If I, I think for him, it doesn't matter if they need him. It matters to him that he can be there. You know, it doesn't matter if they, if he's needed in in that way. It just matters for him to save them. It, at least that's how it feels. I mean, yes, of course, the vanity. He fell for that, but he was enthralled for a moment until you realized your reward would be a tadpole. If you wanted power, you never needed a god, only to live up to your ideal. I like that one. It's not Shadowheart though, unfortunately. If it was if it was Gurtak, he would definitely say you never needed a god. But I mean she's a freaking cleric. Of course she thinks you need a god. So I think um It sounds like you were being enthralled, it's not your fault. It would be nice to think so, but whatever these monsters twist us into. I believe it begins in us. I mean, it might. I won't you make don't excuses. Know. I can't make amends. But I know something of what you came to do. I want to help, if you'll let me. Ketherick is below. He thinks you're no longer a menace. Descend and show him how wrong he is. If there are any more survivors to be found, I'll find them and lead them out of this place. But yeah, I, th I think that's what he wants to be. He wants to be a shield for someone who cannot shield himself. But even if he's not needed, he still would be their shield. Because he can, you know, because he can he can be that. And that hurts really a lot, I think, that he couldn't. Um also his pride probably. And also that he fell for that, of course. I could use another blade in the fight to come. Find your own people. They need you. I don't care what you do. Just get out of my sight. Fine. Good luck, Zevlor. I could use another f uh, blade in the fight to come. Only if you can trust it won't be buried in your back. The Absolute swayed me once before. I won't risk it happening again. Go, my friend. It's not Please. unreasonable. Let me do this much. That's fine. I knew he wouldn't come with us. Oh, we leveled all oh, leveled up now. Nice. Oh, I can't wait to level. That's so good. Mind flare. Mind flare. Wonder if the gods I are want watching all me. the baubles. Because they are all mine. Okay, good. Um should I level on screen? I think I should level on screen. I don't know if everyone cares about that. I care um, that you have the option. And it's the end of the part anyway. We'll see Zeriel's asset maybe next time. I think we'll make a cliffhanger out of this. I'm not going to do multi-classing if you, if you think I would. Uh, no, I don't think I shall. Maybe, with, as I said, with... Um, um, 
Asterion, for example, but otherwise, no. Yes, finally, I got the improved wild, wild strike. So that's three attacks per round per action. That's ridiculous. I love it. And a level five spell slot, which is nice. We gained a cantrip. And we have the Dilophosaurus. I don't like the Dilophosaurus. It's really weak, in my opinion. But we also got the Water Myrmidons. That is because we're a Moon Druid, I believe. This is the normal thing you would, or everyone would get, but this is because of a Moon Druid. And I can tell you, the Myrmidons are ridiculously good. There is a little bug with the Fire Myrmidon, apparently. Because that thing can haste itself, but when it moves, then the haste goes away for some reason. Uh, this is the Myrmidon's Immolation. Ignite with incandescent primordial flames that hasten you. For three turns and concentration, but for some reason when you move, it goes away. We'll test that in a fight where it doesn't really matter, but um, that's kind of sad. Because a normal Myrmidon that you can that you can just call upon as a as a druid because of uh, you know you can you can uh, just evoke um, what's what's the thing summon them summon um, just has one attack with haste two attacks if I become a Myrmidon which costs two charges which is really expensive but I get three attacks if I haste myself I get six attacks and that's ridiculous ridiculously strong especially because they can use scorching strike as no not not this one no sin well they can use cinderous swipe which does an extra fire damage in front of you in a cone yes but it's scorching strike which adds to your normal attack another 1d10 fire damage and it's so good and you can do that six times in a row this is really strong and making the druid a a valid fighter by by a long shot it's really good uh, all of these seem garbage. I don't like the Thorn Whip. It is really not strong at all and not useful. Um, yes, you can pull creatures three meter closer, but uh, that could be good to get someone from up above. Maybe, but it's not that long. It's only nine meters, so... I don't know if that's really that good, but reproduce flame is not great. Hmm... Yeah, not really, and it's until a long rest. I don't know, it's not really good. If you need to ignite something, but we're long f away from that. And poison spray is garbage because it has three meter radius. That's really not good, and most things are immune to poison, what we found. I think we'll take the thorn whip and just see um, what we can do there. Didn't we get another prepared spell? I think we didn't. Well, that's sad. Hmm. Afflicting them with a disease of my choice. I have no idea what that would do. That might be good. Planar Binding might be good. Greater Restoration is a great spell because it can um, it can uncurse us. But yeah, that's fine with him. Now next one, please. Shadow Heart, my beautiful. My beautiful dear Shadowheart, you get Divine Intervention. Oh god, really? You can cast Divine Intervention to invoke your god's aid. Once used, this can never be used again. This is a one-time thing, which can do a lot of damage, which can uh, summon a weapon of your god, which can give you a lot of money or camp supplies, I think it was. Or it's money and camp supplies or something. It has four things that it can do. I'm not sure. Oh, or it can... No, the, the money and camp supplies. And the, the last thing is revive everyone in around you with full health or half health or something. So you can... If everyone goes down, you can use divine intervention and your god will, will revive everyone in the party and, and, and also, uh, I think, allies and something. It's really, really strong. But you can only do it once, so tread carefully. Uh, I want light. To be honest, I think I want light. Because, you know, she is now not of Shah, that's a lie. She's of Salune. She is not of Shah anymore. And you have greater restoration for now. I mean, that's fine. I'm not sure what else I could give you. I could give you Contagion. But, mm. Level 4 spells are all garbage. I mean, Banishment is nice. But it's just... It's just temporarily. It's just two turns. It's like the polymorph. 
And a level 4 spell slot for that? I'd rather upcast Spirit Guardians or my Glyph of Warding. Much rather. Also, Remove Curse is much cheaper than the Greater Restoration, so I don't know why you would do this instead of this. I mean, this has more uses, of course. I don't know. Maybe we should have the Prayer of Healing instead. For after a fight, although that's not much healing anymore. I don't think that's good enough. Even this, I'm not sure if we really want it. Um, instead, having uh, the Beacon of Hope and do the real heal. Even that is not is nothing anymore. 28. I mean, yes, for the whole party and more. I think it's for five people or something. It, nice, but... Mm, mm, it's not a great heal, really. Together with the Beacon of Hope, it could be nice. Unfortunately, this is a concentration spell, which I don't like. In my opinion, this should be a long rest thing. Then it would be worth a slot. And maybe bump it up to level 4. Because we really have nothing in level 4. But this will not stand anyway, because we will skill her in a different way soon. I told I told you long ago that we will re-spec her at some point. And this point is now. Well, not now, but in a in a second. Uh, you have Intimidating Presence. Yeah, that's fine. Wow. Carla, easy peasy, level up. Nice. <laughs> that's why I would never play Barbarian. It's, it's so boring. <laughs> so boring. Just the level up, so boring. Empowered Evocation. Your grasp of Evocation Magic has tightened and you can add your Intelligence modifier to damage rolls with any Evocation spell. His Intelligence is 4. His Intelligence modifier. Which is nice. He will get another ability improvement if we want to. And I think we want that for him. And then he'll have 20 int. And then it's going to be plus 5. To damage rolls. Interesting. So we just get a plus 5. Hmm. I mean, sure. That's nice. That's good. It's more damage. More damage is always good. Uh, do we want minor illusion? Minor Illusion can be quite strong, but I'm not really... I mean, maybe. And we can remain hidden while casting this. And while silenced. I'm not a fan of Acid Splash or Poison Spray, as you might have seen. Friends is interesting. Gain advantage on Charisma checks. Again, a non-hostile creature. The spell can be cast while you are silenced. This is only good in, in story mode, not in fights. I don't know what it would do in fights. Because non-hostile creature, I don't know. So if you're talking to someone and they are not hostile, you could use this uh, to bump up your advantage on a charisma check. But mm. I mean, true strike is really nice. Will I get light? I don't want lancing lights. I guess we get minor illusion. I like friends, but on tactician it's not as good. Okay. Cone of Cold, for sure. Uh, min minor Elemental, never. Useless. Polymorph, never. Find Familiar, meh. Greater Invisibility is nice, and we have Slow here. Or even Hypnotic Pattern, which I do like, because they cannot move or act, is the thing. They cannot attack you. I don't know how they cannot move or act. So they have no actions and can can still attack you somehow. I don't know. But uh, yes, this makes everyone who sees this, and you can use this silence, completely nothing. They cannot do anything. And it's a wisdom save, which is also not often a thing. This is also wisdom, okay. But I think slow is even better. This also affects their actions. Maybe they only get one or something, only one action. But they also lose AC, uh, the dexterity sa saves are reduced, and they lose a lot of movement as well. So, I mean, it's weird. I would actually say Hypnotic Pattern is way better, but it only, only works if they can see. If they're blind, they cannot see it. And slow would still work. I'm not sure. Should we take slow? Gaseous form is interesting. I've never once used blink, unfortunately. I don't don't even have shield. Shield would be an interesting thing as well. And it's only level one spell slot, so we could use it. We could actually use this. 
But I was hoping I find a scroll with that. I don't want to use a level up to get such a low level spell now. Uh, polymorph is garbage. Seeming I don't need. Dominate person. Yeah, is nice. But for level 5, I don't know. It's just one target. I mean, planar binding. I have, I'm more, I have more respect uh, of anything that is not human instead of perspective of humans. Um, or be, before humans. Phantasmal Force. I think we'll take... I took Hypnotic Pattern once. I don't know. 18 meters, 18 meters. So it doesn't make... Oh, this is only two turns. Yeah, let's take the let's take the 10 turns thing, please. Okay. And will God hold monster? Yeah, we didn't get a new slot, unfortunately. I want more slots. That's his problem. He doesn't have enough slots. Look at that. He has nothing here. I mean, now we got minor illusion. Yay, big whoop. Very, very useful. I never even used Mage Hand once, so... It's all useless. I've never used Blink once, weirdly enough. Because for a while, he wasn't in that much danger anymore. And it is a level 3 slot, and level 3 is the most useful one. In my opinion. And most abundant. Oh, you got... You gave me Witch Bolt again, game. I hate you so much. So we got another slot, okay. Mm, I'll take slow. For now. And we'll see how that goes. It's a level... See, another level 3. 3 is so good. The level 3 is comes. so good. It's just the it perfect the slot. No. Anyway, we leveled up. We're level 10 now. Only two more levels to go. That is really, really good. That will help us a lot. Um, but we won't see the asset today. We'll see that in the next part. Thank you all for watching. Leave me a like if you like. Something if you haven't. Follow me on Twitch and come to the Discord. And I see you all in the next one. Blue blob, everyone.